you know, you took on the security issue and found out the security board on the enterprise, and we kind of talked about how they've been integrated. Are, are, do you feel that in order to have this end-to-end -end trust that we've been talking about, that I now need to give up my privacy, my anonymity, or is that going to be something that can continue? That's something we struggle with. Well, I think in the real world, people make these choices every day. I mean, I remember when the credit card was first introduced, people said, oh my goodness, isn't this a problem? The banks will know everything about what I spend my money on. And, but over time, people felt that the benefit of getting credit and the ease of that was a good thing. And they didn't feel abused by the information that the banks collected in the process of doing it. So there's always a, a, a balance required between the people who gave, gather the information and whether the, the, the person with information you, you collected is, uh, is feeling good about what you do with it. Now, I think at Microsoft we made, or I'll call it again, a foundational decision a few years ago, which was uh, to say, look, everything starts in privacy with notice of choice. That if you at least notify people what you're collecting and you give them choice as to whether they participate or not, so that it is an inadvertent collection. You know, then you start with at least the foundation of trust in this, in this privacy battle. Other things I think are, but, but to some extent, the intimacy 